ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode here in Pastiche of Skin. It's an absolute pleasure to have you. Thank you very much for joining us. Today we're going to be playing Tetris Effect. Now, um, I was having technical issues with it there, so thankfully I've got this sorted in time because I want to check out Tetris Effect before... Whoa, before... Oh, wow, whoa. Oh, there we go. <laughs> a bit disoriented in there. Uh, Tetris Effect, we're going to play this for a little while before the demo completely runs out for it in um, a matter of a few hours. It's actually only valid until the 5th of November. So, let's give Tetris Effect a try. You can see, I'm in full 3D, using the VR. Uh, I haven't used VR in a while. This was actually uh, the game that got me to dig back up my VR to try it out. So, let's see. Um, journey mode. Give that a quick try. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, so, uh, no details yet, just play. Uh, no. We'll find the cover of the music. Um, I just, beginner, I'm feeling a bit rusty. Into the deep, I can feel you calling to... Oh no, wait, that was the beach, not into the deep. I haven't played Tetris in so long. Oh! No, God! I made a massive mistake from the very top. His boy Elroy, Jane, his wife. It sounds very damn... Jetson Link. Oh my, it is atmospheric. This is actually very, very loud. Is it showing us too loud on the chat? No, it's not. I'm actually over the top of this ground. But, um, yeah. This is kind of very immersive. This is actually a wonderfully immersive Tetris experience. If you weren't listening to me chat, this would just be chilled out as fuck. Chilled out and relax into this. I need to actually really start focusing on getting lines because if I don't get a Tetris soon, I'm kind of screwed. <laughs> oh, the worst thing is I'm going to need two of them now. Really chill, especially with the music. Ah, oh, come and claim. <laughs> oh, so groovy. Do, 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 do. 
and I remembered how to actually keep a fire brick as well. Awesome. Uh, I'm gonna still make use of this now. Ha! Tetris! Here it comes! <laughs> no! Just before I actually got to use my last line. Ah, oh, that's pretty cool. I like how this zones out. <sighs> this is actually really beautiful visually. It's actually super chilled out. It's really relaxing. It's got the it's got a right tone and feel to it. Close your eyes so you see my vision. Unite the souls so there's no division. Look into the future, we see all seasons. Aiming for the top, but what's the reason? Hands to the sky and realize we're free. We become the legends we were meant to be. Now open your eyes and you will see. I can lead you home, just follow me. I love the fact that it gets more visually complex as you actually get further into the score of the time as well. It's very, very cool. I love the fact that the rotations actually yeah, put a beat to it as well. Very, very well designed. Hey!
It's the fact you get into the rhythm of actually rotating your blocks to the beat of the tune, and that's actually what's keeping me super entertained right now. It is awesome. I'm loving it. I feel like I've joined the tribe. Quite interesting. 
Yeah, C rank um, isn't not the best in the world, but that was wonderfully intense. That was super enjoyable. Yes. Yes, I say. Well, that blew my goddamn mind. And I'm assuming that's actually the three levels that are available here in this beta. Now, obviously, there is a raft of tunes and all leading towards this little bit of the cosmos right here. So, yeah. I'm assuming there's many, 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 many more to come. Um, not even there. I'm assuming that's like the infinite remix mode. Uh, that was super intense. Like, I mean, that was really, really um, engrossing. I really enjoyed that. I, I do love Tetris. I just, I don't know if it's a VR experience. Um, I don't know if it's even like a console experience. I've always, like, Tetris and Portable have always been a synonymous thing. I mean, from its uh, first iterations on the Game Boy and how much time was spent playing that, it's it's a weird idea to actually turn around and try it in a, um, in a VR and a sit-down environment. I'm sure there is intense Tetris players who prefer an arcade machine, prefer a sit-down experience to play in it. That, that was wonderfully engrossing, and the music was excellent. Uh, I think I mispronounced, I didn't, it's not Lumines that this is actually made by the company of, it's actually made by the company behind Res Infinite, uh, which I was a massive fan of. I loved Res whenever it originally came out in the PS2, and on the Xbox whenever it came out in re-release, and I was, I enjoyed Res whenever I played the demo of it, but I didn't actually purchase the game because I've already played that game a fair amount. I kind of know what's going on, but meanwhile with Tetris, this is actually a great, great synergy between uh, visual audio experiences and uh, intimate action gameplay where your your mind goes with the game and the music drags you along on a nice reel. Like the fact that I started like turning pieces in time with the music and trying to fit it in was uh, a nice feeling. So uh, yeah, that was actually, that was pretty damn cool. Um, I'm, a, I'm a fan, I'm a fan. I would actually say check out Tetris Effect yourself. Um, I'm going to switch over back to uh, non-VR, just so I can see a bit better. Woo! Woo! Right. Ah. Ah! That was interesting. Right. So, make sure your audio is still capturing there, okay? Because um, I had no idea while I was strapped inside the helmet. Uh, they, they, once, once, you, once you're strapped into the web on the VR, you don't really kind of keep track of what's going on outside. But uh, yeah, that was, a, that was super enjoyable. Um, yeah, God, I uh, highly recommend Tetris FX for anybody who is actually a Tetris nut. It will, it'll, it'll actually really be enjoyable. People who like puzzle games in general, and anybody who loves, like, like Lumines and loved Res, it's definitely much more of a Res effect than Lumines effect, because Lumines really did um, push its beat and its, uh, the timing of the music, and music is more, almost more important than, say, the, um, actions of the uh, player dropping the uh, dropping pieces essentially like the beat of the music will tell you whenever like your boxes uh, pieces are going to get out of the way in fact playing this makes me want to go back and play lumines so what i'd recommend is uh, if you haven't got if you don't get the chance to play this tetris effect demo because it, like i said it, it ends the end of today it actually just shuts down on the fifth until the release of the game uh go back and play lumines lumines hd is available on nearly every platform anywhere you can find it's as, as almost as big as almost as ubiquitous as the original um Tetris, and also I highly recommend checking out Res on any of its format and platforms, uh, PS2, Xbox 360 in the live arcade, and of course Res Infinite on the PS4. So uh, thank you very much for watching guys, there's plenty of things for you to go and check out. If you have any thoughts, opinions, and ideas about the game and the way I've been playing it, then go ahead and complain in the comments below. So thank you very much for watching, and I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye!